G'day, I'm Michael from Girl Director, and today I want to talk to you about a little product called the WenPod. Now this little device is really handy for making your shots, your video on your iPhone or smartphone smoother when you're moving around. So this is it here. As you can see, it's a pretty funky looking device. And what we do is we just slot our phone into this place here. Now if you've got an iPhone 7 Plus, then it's gonna be bigger, so you'll need to take off any covers that you have. So you're just using the raw machine, just because of the weighting of it. So what you do is you take this part here, and you just slide your phone in there. Now you'll see that it's out of balance initially. And so what you need to do, because this is an iPhone 7 Plus, it's bigger, it needs a counterweight here. So that comes in the box, and you just slide that onto the end, to get your counterbalance. You go as close to the end as you can so that you get as much bounce. It's balancing a bit better there now, you can see. Not 100%, not as much as we'd like. We'd like ideally to sit like that, but you'll see when I turn it on in a sec, it'll actually will stay that way. You have to have it charged. It does charge, it comes with a power adapter. Switch it on, little blue lights come on. And what you'll see is that now it's actually holding steady. It's staying pretty much in the same plane. One thing you'll find is it does shudder if you try and move it. There's a kind of a shakiness to it and that will show up on any footage you do. Now a couple of the things before I show you in the video that I've been shooting and playing with. With the iPhone 7, if you do want to have a microphone plugged in, you'll see that just here it's actually covering up where you plug in your microphone into the power part. So that means that you're going to not be able to use a microphone directly into this while you're using the gimbal. Now the other thing is, you can use it so you use the front camera as well and film yourself as you're talking and walking around. So let's have a quick look at some of the footage that I've been collecting with it. Now in this footage I'm just walking around the house and you can see I'm just moving here and you can see it's quite smooth. It's flowing reasonably well, there's a little bit of a shudder at times, sometimes it catches a little bit and that could be a function of the weighting of this particular phone. Smaller phones, I don't know if they would have that same problem. Now, if we compare the same kind of shooting to just holding the camera normally, you can see there's a bit more movement in that camera. Now, having said that, what you can do is obviously put that into whatever editing program you're using and do a bit of smooth cam on it and that can actually improve the smoothness of both shots anyway. So you want to compare the two. So then as we walk out here, you can see I'm walking a lot more and it's actually quite smooth. And you can see this shot is done without the WEM pod and there's a bit more shutter, it's not quite as smooth. And one of the nice things about the WEM pod is it does have this little button here on the front where you put it down, you'll see it tilts down and it tilts up it's quite smoothly. So you can see these shots here that I'm doing right now are actually where it's tilting up and I'm looking up through the trees, very smoothly panning and I'm moving. You can be quite creative with it and get very smooth shots. Now, what happens when you go for a run? <laughs> I thought I'd try this and so I'm running and you know, it's moving around a bit and the camera actually loses it here where it actually falls over to the side and wobbles a bit. So it's a bit rough. I don't know if it can do it so well. I tried this bit of footage before with a smaller phone and it wasn't too bad. You can see this is actually quite smooth. It doesn't look to me so much like it's running. It's moving quite quickly. And the WEN pod's actually controlling the movement quite well. Now if we just put this bit of footage into Final Cut and do a smooth cam on it, it's actually really smooth. So what do I think of the WEN pod? I think it's quite good. Look, it costs a little bit. On the box here, it's $369. So it's a fair bit of money, but if you like toys and you like playing around with these kind of things, you'll find it really quite a good little product to start smoothing up your movement footage. It's great for cutaways and B-roll footage. That's the WEN pod. 